I, it was inconsistent, and it was, uh, you know, I take responsibility. We did not perform to the level that I think we're capable of playing. That's not to take anything away from Gardner-Webb. Uh, university, we've always had some barn burner games with them. I think the last three years it's gone down right to the wire, maybe four along the way, but uh, I did not feel like we played close to our potential. I felt defensively we did some very good things. Obviously, kickoff return was outstanding uh, today. Kickoff coverage was outstanding as well today, too, but talk about turnovers, you talk about missed assignments, drop passes, uh, missed throws. Uh, foolish penalties, and particularly some of those happened in special teams as well, too. It wasn't indicative of Charleston Southern football. And so we got to go in and we got to take a look at the film. We got to study and find out what uh, the issues are. And uh, I'm confident in the character of our young man. I'm definitely confident in our coaching staff's ability to get this corrected in the future. Talk about Gerald's performance today. Phenomenal. I mean, he's not at 100%, too. He's been banged up. He's been banged up for a number of weeks. Obviously, didn't even play in the Hawaii game in and out, and uh, he was one of the movable parts that made things a little bit difficult at times uh, with some of our injuries that occurred during the game. Uh, but when he's on the field, he gives it all in everything that he does. And those kickoff returns, I mean, they tried bouncing it, they tried kicking it deep, kicking it uh, sky. And the key thing is, when it's in his hands, some good things happen. He's an exceptional player, and he ranks nationally with as good as there is in FCS football.